Hi everybody and welcome to DK2 Deep Motions video. Hope you can hear me. I've had to move my microphone way over there so it doesn't think it's a hand. This is called Planetarium with the Leap Motion. As you can see, all these good people. I have a location. You can move it. Whatever you want. Move down here. A tutorial over here but we're going to we're gonna get straight into it so uh, let's hit start so this is the uh, rather educational <laughs> it's, it's uh I remember going to planetarium when you were young. I'm gonna go next week, or now you've got one in your house. You've got a Oculus Rift. So let's see the navigation system. Ah, it's so gorgeous, isn't it? All right, let's get away from. It. I'll just have to shout a bit, talk a bit louder, but uh, back a bit. Left hand menu. I haven't fixed this. I've just, I've really just downloaded this, and it, I've been on it for a wee while. And I thought I'd record it and show you what it's like. And this. <laughs> First, I have these perfect working. Absolutely. We we'll have a time, a date, constellations, star names, and Milky Way. And we can change them in this. We can edit them. We can edit the uh, calendar. So we can. Changes the uh, star positions, which is just the amount of work that's gone into this. It's just Draco, right? Anyway. You can edit the uh, constellations, you can make them brighter. You can put the labels up bright. And you can put the Milky Way. Oh, turn it on. Up bright. Oh, very beautiful. I like this. This is really works really well as you can see. Um change date, you can change star brightness, the depth control, false colour, star brightness. So you can put the star brightness oh no, come back, come back. Um just put it down to medium. me saying how well you were doing. I have to keep my head up. It's depth control. I'll show you that in a minute. That's how I ended. So that is done. Oh my god, that's done. Any favourites? And what you can do also is I'll show you this. this the bottom. We've got this Glow, this uh, compass. We've got the Earth at night, and you can see where you are on that screen. Put your location in. You can see the stars from where you are. So this, where oh, you turn your hand up, that way. Light. Okay, we'll get sit back and leave it. Shouldn't see any other. desk is in the way I have to sit, sit right back. You probably can't hear me if I sit too far back. Then it wouldn't work. I put my, my table in. Grab it. There we go. And then you can move. 
across the uh, earth. Let the uh, stars change. Okay. So we'll try and get somewhere. Do you recognize anywhere? <laughs> There's Europe. Europe. So, uh, let's be in Portugal. too much time on this this machine <laughs> but it's there we go. Well, anyway you have to sit well back away from everything right and you can also do this if you like Cygnus you can reach out or oh, no, that's not Cygnus what you would have done too bright so uh, you can turn those off star labels off Milky Way off I put star brightness up I put false color up depth control up <laughs> and now we have just a star in that and there you go 3D is just staring things really against all the lights on the earth. And this is all mapped out properly, so you can go back to your, your end thing. You can put your constellation, constellation back, or oh no, or back. That's like when it doesn't like both hands up. Hold on, go back a bit. Away from everything. What's it saying, Rob? Oh, it's saying my neck motion later on around my neck. There we go. Put the uh, constellations back up. Star brightness down a little bit. Put the uh, star labels back on. We can see what they are. Uh, uh, Alta, I just want to stand up and just need to get out of my spaceship. <laughs> Keep going forward to the microphone. 
loop doesn't want to work. Put the Milky Way up full whack. Like this, so we can see it. There it is. That's my, that's my knee. read the instructions for this. Evidently I haven't. Where do I want to go? Where are you all from? And it changes the constellation, so... Uh, uh, that's so good! It's very, 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 very interesting. This is the... you could, you could learn a lot. Like this, you can learn a whole lot. Put the constellations back on. Past the gate. Star labels back on. Do a bit of learning. Put the Milky Way. Oh, hang on. Put the Milky Way back on. Not full of whack. <laughs> and the false color and the depth. I like this one. We turn it wee bit. It's working so well. Stars. There we go, that's, that's probably it. Max, so. Uh, a lot of these. And no idea, you think that they're just 2D and then you bring them in. Uh, oh, and then you just hold it in your hand. There's the names of the... Oh, it's so well done. Oh, the wrong hand, I think it's this hand, I think. Come on, there you go. Oh, track. Oh, <laughs> way back, way back. Absolutely, what a wonderful job has been done on this. Just turn everything on, you know, the Milky Way up full. Absolutely beautiful, what a beautiful demo, absolutely gorgeous. So much work must have went into this. Just for someone like me, just to come and just give us silly views on it. Like, brilliant, absolutely brilliant. Thank you very much for this experience. And I hope you all go out and have a wee go at it. Thank you very, very much. I'll catch you again in the next one. Goodbye. <laughs>